Hi guys, this is just a quick tip for anyone running a Hackintosh or anyone who finds himself with Mac and Windows and transferring big files. Um, if you ever tried to do that, you'll know that there's issues with all three of the main drive format types. So the old one, FAT32, Mac and Windows can read and write both, but the problem with it is, is you can't have over 4 gig. Personally, I had this issue because I had a 2 terabyte hard drive and a MacBook, and I converted all my DVDs onto that um, hard drive in a DVD media format. So that's like a, a lossless format in the sense that it has all the bonus features, all the scene selection, subtitles, all of that. So it's just a, pretty much a copy of the DVD, and they're way bigger than 4 gig. They're like sort of 7, 8 gig. Um, so I used OSX journaled, but as you can see on journaled, Windows can't read or write that, and I find myself on Windows quite a lot, and sometimes I just want to whack a movie on. So I wanted to be able to read and write Mac on on both. For Mac, it's not really that much of an issue, because when I'm on my Mac partition, I can see the NTFS drives, which are the Windows format. Um, but I can't write to them, but that's not too bad because I just leave them on the Windows thing and drag them across onto the Mac one. It's not perfect, but it does the job. Um, but I found this program which essentially allows this to turn green. So uh, win when I'm on Windows, I can see and read my um, Mac drives. And all you do is you f get this program here called Mac Drive. You just install it and then you just ignore it forever. It just stays down the bottom, keeps out your way. And all it really does is, now when I look at this, I can see all my drives, and these ones are Mac formatted ones, so if you look at these, they're NTFS, all of them. And then these ones are all, all uh, HFSJ, which is just Mac OS X journaled, extended, or whatever. Um, so you can see here I've got my SSD, a spare hard drive, and then my main hard drive on Windows. And then on Mac I've got uh, an SSD and my main hard drive on Mac and normally I wouldn't be able to see these at all um, so it, it would essentially be like this I could uninstall it and show you but I didn't really see the point uh, and then this one here is just my um, it's a C Seagate elements I think 2 terabyte and so if I go on here you can see what I mean about the uh, DVD media stuff <laughs> Um, yeah, and but these are yeah way over four gig. So yeah, you just install this program, um, and it allows you to see all these drives. Uh, it doesn't help you on Mac. You still could only see these and drag it across, as they say. But it just means you can go on here, and I I can make new folders and stuff like that. I can delete them. It just works fine.